शूट शूट वॉट इज द बिगेस्ट स्ट्रेंथ दैट यू हैव सो एक्सप्लेन अबाउट योर स्ट्रेंथ दैट कैन बी एनी थिंग योर नॉलेज नॉलेज इज कॉन्फिडेंस योर कॉन्फिडेंस मे बी योर स्किल सेट्स राइट योर एम्बिशन वॉट एवर यू फील दैट यू आर एबल टू एक्सप्लेन इट आउट आई थिंक यू शुड बी डूइंग इट फॉर एग्जाम्पल हाउ नवीन हैज अप्रोच दिस क्वेश्चन इज माई बिगेस्ट स्ट्रेंथ इज माई नॉलेज which helps me to bring my confidence every time uh, my parents are also one of my biggest strength as they always stand up by me you know boost me up when i feel weak and my self confidence is going down i think the best armor of my life is my family my values and my parents give me the reason uh, why we should take you in your company why we should hire you right every HR questionnaire round would certainly have such type of question so explain about those special qualities you have and how you are different from others and what best you are going to give them give to the company as they are hiring you right so you need to be very very clear on these parameters what navin did was he answered it again beautifully well i am a very good hard worker and also a quick learner i can handle things in a smarter and a better way where everybody fails to do that and also i am a good decision maker i can take right decisions right time which is important thing for any candidate to work in a company as yours so think about what is good in you maybe if you are a good listener fast learner good decision maker a uh, problem solver very process focused you can choose from anything and phrase your answer but do not sound too obsessive too many skill sets what you possess the best i think you should envelop your answer encircling your answer in and around that what navin did was a fantastic show so if you have strength you must be having your weaknesses never tell that you don't have weaknesses think and tell this answer before you land out think about it do you have weaknesses you must be having surely so think about those which are there existing so answer in such a way that your weakness is one type of your strength always weaknesses comes out from your strength if you say i'm very bad temper which may be really your weakness but don't share this one because if you do so then they may have some bad impression on your profile it would need more kind of an explanation towards it so avoid this share the other ones for example something which is not your weakness but it may also be your strength right how navin did for example i am good at communication i would say on a scale of 1 is to 10 i think i am 5 or 6 but i know this is also my area of improvement to take it to 8 or 9 this can be a fantastic way but how navin approached this is yes i am having a weakness i can't spend time leisurely i have to do something to spend my time so i keep on searching for any work fun making or any creative thing so that i can keep myself strongly occupied always i'm trying to overcome this by making use of time in a useful way instead of doing simple funny things what a way try and learn the approach that is most important right what made you to come here to attend this interview why our company why us it can be anything like these but the question is don't simply tell that i need a job as we all know that we need some kind of an earning financial independence is our next objective if you even give the same answer just try to explain you want to earn money but how how navin did it i have pretty reasons for this firstly i have my one of the ambition to work with such a multinational company like yours secondly i want to have some earning coming my way as of now i am 22 and i don't want to depend on my parents for my lifestyle next i want to uh, see myself in a good position where everybody respect me and this organization is such a famous organization that it will definitely give me that kind of a reputation that i desire of myself some trickier question uh, are you interested to work on shifts how this goes with navin navin 
uh, very cleverly he answers yes i am a bachelor he smiles so i don't have any issues with changing my shifts and all i can work in different environment any environment for that matter so navin was able to handle this question very nicely always be willing to learn you are starting your career so you need to be open with your learning pattern this answer actually clearly is a self explanatory of what you think and how your willingness to learn another question give me an example of your good hard worker this is the term that navin used good hard worker tagged you named yourself explain if you are not let's say if you're not a good hard worker you say say it like a disciplined worker or a very meticulous worker or a smart worker or a street smart uh, you know personality i think you need to be ready with maybe if you sh- showcase your leadership quality whatever you are right you need to be prepared with one example and what navin did was a fantastic show once again i can tell you this with one of the experiences of my life in the time of our college anniversary we plan for a skit and some of them didn't turn up to help us but i took the responsibility arranged everything before a day staying for a long time in our college and finally made it a big success everybody appreciated my big work we certainly do a lot of things on our way uh, when we graduate but we need to you know identify what you have done and correlate with the example be it discipline be it leadership be, be it problem solving decision making planning organizing getting resourceful whatever i think we all have done some of the other point we just need to be ready with that example next question is all right mr navin let's have some generic question but a trickier one tell me how will you react when you are under pressure so to answer such type of question it's better you take some examples of your own life and explain them how you reacted in those situations so navin was smart enough to answer this and beautifully well i'm a guy with more patience compared to others if you take up an example of my project work in my last semester of engineering we had over project review and lab review which had to be completed in very less moment of time i took a project which will take more time than that i have to plan my presentations and records and everything by the end of the day i completed and submitted all in time so i feel myself proud for that how well he explained not only he chose something which was just you know not conventional but he had an explanation he he, he gave good amount of time energy efforts and completed in uh, you know within that stipulated period just to sound that he had patience and he liked to work under pressure even otherwise whatever you might have done for the first time for example appearing for a board exam appearing for taking up science appearing for j triple e and taking up engineering college doing a lot of assignments for the first time taking up internship doing a, a mini or a major project every time that you might have faced you know first thing in your life whatever that milestone that you have faced you might have faced it for the first time it is all that pressure so you can definitely look back in retrospect and say that every time you walk this life confidently facing that kind of a pressure so you know you understand that life is will always throw challenges with certain element of pressure in it and you know how to handle it because you have handled it in the past so well remember this okay let's try and understand this this question right what are the things that irritates you mostly in the workplace now such types of questions are asked so that they can take out some negative areas of yours try to be smarter to understand that something which is might be your uh, gray area or something which you are falling short of you need to work at it and answer it smartly now how navin answers here is how the approach you need to understand it getting irritated if somebody interrupts me in my work i cannot resist it if i am into work and someone comes and stops me without a reason i get irritated second time i get irritated is when people gossip when they can be constructive right even if they continue i will try to say them you know politely not to disturb my work or not to talk on this right and no other chances that i would ever get irritated so something that i don't take personally i don't get irritated but these two conditions are definitely definitely that keeps me 
irritated. What, what a nice way to answer.